Guys, Andrew here and welcome back to Drew Tutorial and if you're new, special welcome to you. Now guys, did you know that you can access the world clock on your Windows 11 PC or even within Windows 10 as well? It's very easy. Before we jump in guys, would you mind taking a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button because this will let me know that you found value within this video. And on top of that, the biggest benefit is that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Now let's continue. All you have to do, click the Windows key on your keyboard and simple type in clock, right? And you'll find the clock up. If you're not able to find the clock up, you can easily go ahead and download this from the Microsoft Store. So if you type in store, you'll find the Microsoft Store in your system and you can easily go ahead and search for clock hit enter and you will find a bunch of clocks there so you'll have the windows clock you can find whatever clock you can find here and you can easily go ahead and install clock and you'll be able to have the world clock available there as well right so how do you go about using this because most likely this is going to be on your windows pc it's there by default so you can easily access it so type in clock and open up the clock application from here on the left hand side you have a bunch of options right and you can go ahead and click on work clock. As you can see here, you click on this. And as you can see here, if you look closely to the top, you have the daylight. So the lighter part is basically which countries right now are really impacted by the daylight or let's say they have daytime right now. And this little area here is basically countries that are go that are currently having the night time, right? So how do you go about adding clock? So as you can see, what it does now, have your local time here. So based on where you're living or your computer is set to your lo local time, you will have the local time here. And if you look closely here, it is showing your location pinned, right? So this is my current location here. And this is where I current, I'm currently living, right? So let's say you want to access or let's say you want to add a different country. I'm gonna add a few more countries. Let's add a country that is currently impacted by the nighttime right now. So in this era here, I'm originally from Jamaica. So what's gonna happen? I'm gonna simply click the plus icon here. Let's say I wanna know what's going on in Jamaica. I can simply type in Jamaica. And as you can see, I have two options here. I have the Kingston and I also have Montego Bay. I'm originally from Montego Bay. So I'm gonna simply go ahead and click in Montego Bay, then click and add. And as you can see here, it is currently showing that it has the minus seven. So currently minus seven hours there. And it is currently showing that it is currently night. So just about closer to 2 a.m. in the morning there, if you look at it, you can see that the Jamaica time here is currently minus seven than my current location, right? So how about I try something else? Let's look for something such as, I believe we can try somewhere within like uh, New Zealand or Australia. Let's add something like that. So let's type in New Zealand and we can go for Christchurch, for example. I know that area, so let's click on that. And as you can see, they have a plus 10 hours there. You can see that they're going closer to 7 p.m. there. So guys, you see how you can basically add the world clock there on your Windows 11 PC. You also have the edit, so you can simply go ahead, click and edit there, and you can always go ahead and remove some of those ones that you no longer need and you can add you can click the check mark there again to have them there as well right so if you find this useful guys as you can see as well one more thing that once you add those different locations you can see the pinpoint there for those locations so you can see where these countries are currently located on the world map there as well here you have it guys i really hope you found value within this video and if you do don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when i release future videos just like this one thank you guys for watching and see you next time